Hi guys and welcome. If you're interested in how to build your own landing page or website fast, easy and without an extra efforts, this video can be handy because in this video I want to provide you with an all information that you need to build your own landing page or website really, really fast. Now I want to show you the platform that allows you to make that happen. Uh, and really without an extra efforts because everything is drag and drop, everything is working properly and this platform you can really count on. And there are a lot of interesting tools that you can uh, use to build your own landing page uh, or web page or website. But I don't want to make this video one hour long or two hours long. I saw those tutorials. I don't want to waste your time. That's why uh, I want to show you, I want to highlight all the main features of this platform. So jump into this video and let's go straight to the dashboard inside of the platform. That's how it looks from inside. And if you need to build a landing page, just press and create new landing page. And you'll be on the page, you'll get on a page that uh, gives you the opportunity to choose from one of a lot of templates and uh, you can choose uh, those templates with a type, for example, so you can sort it with an industry. And here in this spot, you need to be as specific as possible because uh, it will save you time to uh, to build everything. Let's start building just this one because all the editing features are pretty the same. And that's what I want to show you. And in, in the end of this video, you'll get an idea of how to build it by yourself. First of all, you need to give your page a name and after you'll be on the editor. And that's what I want to show you. Okay, here you go. We have a simple layout here. Uh, we have just one page. I want to show you all the buttons. So layout sections, widgets, styles and settings. You need to understand that all uh, all the landing pages and all the websites built with uh, sections with a layout. So if you go to layout, you see which sections do you have here? The hero and the footer. OK, hero is this one and footer is this one. If, for example, you need uh, some more information, you can add a section. And there's a pre built templates of sections that you can choose and that you can uh, use to build your own landing page. If you didn't found the proper section, you need to, uh, you can use the blank one. And as I told you is everything is drag and drop here. And you just drag and you see the words drop here. Okay, let's drop it here. We're going back to layout and we see that we have now a lot of things to do, but the footer is right after the hero and we need to make it like that. We need to get it down. So about we don't need this about section actually just to show you how it's happening. Uh, I can delete this section. I can duplicate it, can make it visible or invisible and with this arrow, you can see which um, which blocks inside of each section you can find and you can add a column or you can add a row straight from here. We don't need this section here, so we're going to delete it. All right. Now we have uh, we have the footer. We have some blank page and we jump into widgets. Those are widgets that you can use to build your own things on your landing page. But I'm going to press show last text, image plus text, image video button form line and space. That's actually everything that you will use to build your simple landing page uh, fast and, and easy and everything is drag and drop. For example, I want the video to be here. I'm just drag and drop in here. All right. All the editing features happening with this pencil and you can find this pencil button on each uh, each element on your page. You see, you can find all the pencils pretty here. So drag and drop. For example, I need a button here. I can drop it here and you see there's a button. But I want this button to be in the center of this field 
And this divider is also a very interesting uh, thing. You can just grab it and move it. And you see that all the elements reshaping itself. It's very, very convenient, really. Uh, if you're building from uh, from the ground, for example, from the scratch, and you can grab spacer, you can drop it here, and you can move things around. That's how it's simple. So, how to edit the uh, background of the section? All the editing features of each section is happening with this three dots button. You just press on it, and you can edit section settings, add section buffer below, duplicate, copy, or delete the same uh, as in the layout so you press an added section settings and you see that there's no background color or there's no background image if you choose a color just to show you for example we're gonna add a new one uh it's some kind of blue for example yeah and you can change the opacity also and it's gonna be half transparent so it's similar to this color. I want this page to be uh, in one style. And you see everything is happening really, really fast and easy. Or you can add an image. Uh, and also you can change the size of each block manually. Or it can be automatically shaped. I want it to be bigger, a little bit bigger. No, it's too much. Okay, so here you go. I showed you all this stuff and let's jump inside this section and you see there's an image and I want to change this image. Uh, it's Peace Yoga. Okay, let's change it to some other. You can use the images that you uploaded previously. You can buy images straight from the platform and one picture is about $8. Now, I will not buy the picture right now. I will upload it straight from my computer. Yeah, cool. The picture is here uh, and you see the picture is not um, not actually very great because you see the hands are caught and the hat is caught. So we go into added section settings and we changing the shape of this uh, of this section. And you see uh, this picture is pretty sharp and pretty colorful, but I want to make this blue color to uh, to overlay. You see this great opportunity to okay, let's add some color and let's change the opacity. And we have like some kind of filter on it. Maybe a little bit less. Yeah. That's how it looks. And you see the picture is now with a filter and, and it looks great. As for me, I like this shape. And you see all the things are here. All right. So here in widgets, you have text, image and text, image, video, button and form. And the main issue, main point of any landing page or website is to get a new client, to get an information from a visitor, uh, to get... Uh, like some kind of information uh, of contact and how you can contact with uh, that human being that left you uh, uh, that left you contact information. So everything is happening with the buttons. I'll show you with this button. It's uh, already done and this button was in the template. So you need to edit the click event. This is very important before you go live with your uh, with your website, you need to make sure that all the buttons works properly. So what's going to happen when somebody will press the button? He'll see in a pop up or Calendly pop up, jump to page section. Uh, if you have a button like read more, for example, yeah, link to landing page and external URL. In most cases is the pop up. Edit the pop up itself. You see all the colors. Everything is happening with this pencil button. I'll not show you how uh, how to edit the tags because it's simple and easy and here you go this is the form and you need to edit integrations here uh, what does it mean integrations how you'll get an information about new lead uh, it can be sent to your email or you can add an external service of email marketing like one of those from the list that i'll show you yeah here it is active campaign a weber get response mailchimp 
very and very powerful tools. You can uh, integrate those tools if you have account for the for them. Uh, you can integrate it to your landing page, uh, and all the information will drop to, uh, to those tools. Or you can integrate everything with a Zapier uh, for Google Sheets, for example, or uh, or Zoom. Maybe you want to Zoom or Trello, and so on and so on. You need to uh, make sure that you get an information and it's jump into some kind of your CRM and so on. But actually, if you're starting, if you're just first time building your own landing page, it's pretty enough to get information to your um, inbox of your email. In case if you have no much, um, much orders and much leads, like it's 100 per day, for example, you'll not handle it for sure. And you need the system that will handle it by by itself. So the fields, which information do you need? Yeah, it, just, it can be only email or you can add a field with a first name, for example. And you see the first name is the second actually and with the small arrows you can um, make it on the first spot and that's pretty it you can add more fields but i suggest you to use only first name and uh, the email because uh, okay for example phone number done as and you see lead matter is not so good right now and this this tool shows how your page will convert uh, your visitors to customers so less fields more clients okay we're gonna delete the phone number and uh, we're not trying to call uh, we're not trying to call our customers uh, because email is pretty enough and you can integrate everything with um, with email marketing tools and email marketing tools will then send information send updates and all the all the information that you need can be sent to email straight and email marketing is like one of the basic things that you can use to market your um, your offer Okay, and the actions. What's gonna happen when somebody will uh, give you information, the first name and email, and press the button like send, okay? What's gonna happen? Remain on page, external URL, landing page, or default lead pages, thank you page. So you can build one more page with a thank you, with all, all the styles, with all the things, uh, and it can be landing page, like external, the new one for this, for this option. Or you can add a lead magnet if you uh, promising for your visitors like uh, I'll send you some guide or checklist or uh, or some useful information for free uh, and I'm changing it for um, email so we're gonna send you to an email and you can add a lead magnet straight here and that's that's pretty it guys that's pretty it everything is simple and everything is pretty easy now let's jump to styles here uh, in this section you can edit the page background to get a parallax effect when you scroll the um, site or while you scroll the landing page the picture will be uh, will be held on, on the background and this is great effect I like that so much if you want such you can use it with a page background here or you can add an image or you can add a color but with a color it will not be uh, understandable that this is parallax effect phone styles here in the fonts you can change all the fonts instantly for entire page straight from here so like headline font and text font you change in it here and everything is changed for entire page that's pretty cool page width wide medium or small like it's up to you favicon this small small picture um, on the search bar and custom CSS and so on let's go to settings because there are important information about that SEO definitely you need your page to be visible to search engine machines and you need to take care about all the title all the description and all the keywords if you don't want it, um, search engines to index this page you can switch on the flag here uh, and it can be like private for example social if somebody or you by yourself want to share your link link to your landing page to some uh, Facebook or or some else place social media 
this how it's gonna look uh, there so you need to upload the recommended you know, pixels or larger yes yeah, as, uh, aspect ratio and so on and you can upload the picture here social URL and so on analytics definitely Google Analytics tracking ID um, you need to switch it on of course you need to uh, switch on the Facebook pixel if you run an ad campaigns through Facebook and language of the page that's pretty it guys that's pretty it I showed you how you can uh, edit all those things I showed you that you can move things around uh, you can reshape things you can add some widgets here for example let's add it a spacer here and let's move it down or, or yeah you get it so I showed you how to edit all the things here and I showed you uh, main information actually that you will use to build up your own landing page nobody except you can uh, explain to your customers uh, what is the best sides of your business? Uh, nobody except you can describe your business better than you. So it's actually up to you. And I gave you tools to make that happen. So I wish you good luck. I hope this information was useful as it promised. Uh, like this video is under 20 minutes, not one hour long because uh, your time is really precious. Thank you so much want to remind you that you can jump straight to platform from this video the link is in the description and if you consider this video as useful please use our link now that would be great thank you so much have a great day take care and bye bye